know that one of the most important areas of life to focus on is your home and protecting it from all the storms that may come. And thankfully, there are so many new technologies coming out that can help us do that. I'm here at CES 2024, where they are unveiling all kinds of cool smart home stuff. And I want to take you on a tour of some of the best stuff that I found here in the show, starting with this, the home of the future from TCL, of all people. Surprised to find that, but this is actually really cool, what they have going in the booth there. So I want to show you two things. Let's go. Okay, the first thing that I was impressed with here at the TCL booth was this in-wall in window, I guess you can call it, AC unit. It's like the cheap ones you get at Home Depot. I used to have one in my old studio shed, and that thing was so loud and so ridiculous. This thing is almost silent. It's like having a mini split, but it's all self-contained. It's super energy efficient, and it has this technology that, that doesn't allow it to kind of just get hot and cold and hot and cold and kick on and off. It really modulates the temperature just to keep it a real even temperature the whole time. So I'm building a new kind of pool house, studio shed at my house in the backyard. I'm definitely hoping to get one of these there because it's gonna be much more affordable than putting in a whole mini split system for such a small space. So if you need a small space, this is coming out in a few months, definitely something you should check out. The other thing I wanna show you guys today is their residential energy management system. I didn't know TCL did this, but this is really exciting. They have all the electric appliances that you could need for your house to protect your family in the event of an outage or anything like that. We have our batteries, solar panels, your heat pump HVAC, and the heat pump water heater. I'm really trying to switch all my stuff over to electric, and I'm excited that there's more options now on the market or coming to the market here in the US soon. One of the coolest smart home devices here at CES is this GoV Curtain 2 right behind me which you can see has different scenes. This is Santa going by with the reindeer. And you put this on your garage door or wherever you want, a big wall, and you can program all kinds of different scenes in it. I am so looking forward to flexing on all my neighbors with this come holiday season. And if you guys remember, I already have the permanent outdoor lights, which are sort of like Christmas lights that live there all year round. And you can program all these things to work together. They have this new AI functionality in the app called Lighting Bot. And eventually you're gonna be able to ask it to create a scene for you. And it'll just automatically do it by asking it to say, make a Super Mario Brothers scene or something like that. So the Govi Curtain Light 2, super cool, smart tech. Also, they have some fun stuff on the inside. So here on the gaming setup, you have all the kind of more neon, exciting lights. And I actually am going to use some of these for my new studio, which you'll be seeing very soon. Check these guys out here. These are actually programmed based on what's happening on the screen to change as that scene changes. You've got these guys here, and there's also ones on the back of the monitor that are more flexible. So if you have a scene like this, or maybe someone in your family that's a gamer, this is something you absolutely need to check out. I also particularly like these little hexagon. Kind of reminds me of Qbert, if you remember the game Qbert. Maybe I'm aging myself there. But all of this stuff is just so seamless and it works with all the other products they have. So you can have a whole theme go on in a room or outside in your house, wherever you want. It all works well together. So Govi is definitely crushing it here at CES 2024. And thanks again, Govi, for sponsoring this video. And stay tuned for more because I have a lot of exciting things planned with all the different Govi options we have at my house. I'm here at the Kohler booth where I'm learning about personalized showering rituals with their new Anthem Plus showering system, which is just absolutely insane. If you have the need, this is definitely something you're gonna to wanna to check out for your home with what it can do with modulating the flow and the temperature and everything. Let's have a look. This here is their latest. This is the Anthem Plus digital showering system. And it's this little controller here and it can control the temperature of all these different shower heads and everything independently. This is really beautiful. I really like how simple and elegant this is. It's not a screen. It's almost like a Kindle-like material. Just nice, like solid to touch. You can go individually, or you can change what's in the zone, or you can change them both at the same time. Like that. Put them both at 94, now I do both. If I wanna change the flow all the way off, min, max. If I wanna change what's actually going, I can just turn them all on and off. There's two different zones. And they're all off except for one. And then I can go, shower is warming up. Now I can turn them all back on. This is actually the brains of the operation. 
This is essentially, though it takes the water from your hot water heater that's already there, and it runs through these different valves and these little heaters to change the flow, to change the temperature, as well as to control the lights and any sounds you have built into your bathroom. Again, imagine what it's like to have a shower with 16 different shower heads. But if you do, you're definitely gonna want this from Kohler here. Really bringing some smart home tech to market that uh, the future is really cool if this is what it's like. <laughs> I like this. And of course, when it comes to a smart home, you need to protect it. And there are so many options out there when it comes to security cameras and security systems. Here, I have one that I'm really impressed with. This is from a company called RioLink. And there are just a couple things I wanna point out because there's so much here to talk about. But one is this little solar panel that puts out six watts of power, which can power almost all these different cameras right here, which means that if you don't have the ability to actually run power to it, or let's say it's on a tree outside or even a wilderness camera, you pop that little guy up and it just comes straight out, straight out solar to USB-C. I've never seen that before. That's really, really cool. All these record locally, you put SD cards in them. So if the internet connection goes down, it doesn't matter, they're still recording. And it's Wi-Fi 6 enabled. So you actually have a system here where it can run on Wi-Fi 6, which gives you just really, really great speeds. And there's one other thing that blew me away when I saw this booth, come on. So inside of this box, you have this little house sitting there and you can see what those two different cameras look like on it. On top, you have this Reolink Color X technology and on the bottom, you have the standard black and white night vision. So this is like what I have at my house and this is what I want at my house. So Reolink really doing some magical stuff here that is beyond my understanding of how cameras work, but definitely cool and worth checking out. This has to be one of the most innovative booths and smart home technologies that I found here at CES. This is a new wireless charging standard called Key. You're familiar with Qi, the thing you put your phone on the pad and it charges? It's like that but for appliances. Check this out. So this countertop looking uh, material here has this little symbol, which means that this guy, this appliance, which has no wires, there's nothing here. I just bring that guy over and the power automatically is being supplied through that port. I can push the button, have it start running. No cords at all, and when I pull this off, it just dies like that. So this is a few years out, they said, and this one here is your induction cooktop, which will be coming out within a year or so, where you could actually replace an induction cooktop or put a new one in that had both the ability to do a pan as well as the ability to do the key wireless appliance charging here. Very cool because I think in the future you'll see this just integrated seamlessly, no more wires from a design standpoint. And I was told it can put out up to 2.2 kilowatts, which means that you can have something like this probably to charge your car one day, which is really nuts. So super powerful, super smart, really impressed with this. Stay tuned for more on this in the future because you're going to start seeing it soon. So that's it for CES on the smart home side of things, but stay tuned for more as there is so much to cover coming soon.